what's up everyone welcome back to my channel life as tisha marie and today i have the reviews the wax um warm reviews for the bricks that are coming out april 10th um so the first thing i want to say is i actually love every single one um i do have my favorite and i do have my least favorite so we're gonna get straight into it um we'll just go ahead and start with what i have on top this one is the pink apple and nectarine this is pink apple and golden nectarine dance in a field of wild poppies with lush sugar cane okay so this one was actually really really nice i enjoyed it um i guess the only bad thing or negative thing is it's not that strong at all so i have two that are gone and what i did because this is a brick so if you guys don't know bricks are humongous they're like basically um basically like five and a half of our normal size uh bars into one so it's a lot of wax it's almost a whole pound of wax so i took two and i cut them in half each one and then i put it in my open concept i have four warmers in my open concept so what i did like i said was take two of the cubes and i cut both of the cubes to make it into four big pieces and i put it all around i could smell it um especially like when it first started melting and stuff but it's for me it didn't even last a whole 24 hours um but it was really nice and i did enjoy it i i may pick up another brick of it i'm not sure yet but um it's good so pink apple and nectarine so it's not too strong. I wish it was stronger because I definitely would pick up another one for sure. But so that was pink apple and nectarine. Next one. Oh man. This. Oh y'all. Yeah. Let me read it first. This is Orchard by the Sea. An apple orchard flourishes beneath sea salt skies with whispers of crystal linens and green mango. Oh, it's so good. I didn't think I was gonna like this the way I like this. Like I knew I was gonna like this, but I really like this. And I did this in the bedroom and the bathroom that's connected to the uh, master bedroom. Um, and it was good. So I used the whole cube. I put that, I split that in half because I have two warmers in my room and then I have a warmer in the bathroom that's connected. So I took a piece of, I don't know if y'all can see that. It's kind of messy, but I took a piece of that one and put it in there and it was really good. And it's actually really strong, at least in my bedroom. I haven't tried it in an open concept, but in my bedroom, this was good. And I am going to try it in my living room next. Um, really, really good. Like, it, it's a really clean scent. And you get a touch of that, uh, is it mango? Uh, yeah, the green mango. So you get a touch of that green mango. You do get some that linen scent. And you also get that sea salt. But all that mixed together is actually really, really good. So this is actually one of my favorites. And I'm definitely getting another brick of this. Orchard by the Sea. So that was that next i have beach daisy honeydew melon wild daisies and green apple make a bouquet of fresh picked paradise so this one is floral um i did this one in my open concept this i did do the two full bricks i cut them in half split them between four and this is really really pretty um a lot of people like this scent the only thing is it's not strong you know like it smells so so good but it just it wasn't strong and i like them really really strong like i like scents to like hit me in the face so if you're new here yes i like to just walk in and woo as long as it doesn't give me a headache but this is a really good floral this is really really good the daisies the green apple it's just really really good it's it's super pretty um very light so i'm not gonna pick up another brick of this i don't think maybe i don't know i don't think so you guys because like i said I, I like them strong and i feel like it'd be pointless for me to um get another brick but i will hold on to this for a while um maybe as it sits in you know marinates a little more the oils and stuff it'll be stronger but yeah that's beach daisy it was really really pretty so that one this one from last year i already knew that this one is a good performer let me read cucumber and cactus water crisp cucumber wades into refreshing cactus water and sea salt so this came out last year in our summer collection it was three bars and this was one of them i had this in the open concept i split two big cubes into four 
And this, oh my God, y'all, just, it's super, super, I see why a lot of people put this in their club. Super clean, super fresh, super green. It's all that in one. I really, really like this one. And it was strong. So you already know out of the five, this is like one or my number one or my number two. Probably my number two. Cause yeah, my number two. So this is really good. If you have it, try this. I suggest you do if you're really into those clean green scents. Then this is the one for you. Cucumber and cactus water. It's super, super good. And you do get a little of the cucumber as well, but it's good. So it's like a clean, clean cucumber. Good. Then the last one is Summer Berry Melon. Cassava melon, strawberry, raspberry, and pineapple burst on the scene in a fruity and fun sensation. Okay, so this was really good. Um, I put this in my open closet. There's two right here missing. Y'all already know, I split them into four. For four. Um, it was really, really strong when I first put it in and then it kind of died off around like the, I wanna say about, six to eight hours it got really light for me so i don't know if anybody else had that with this but it was super strong and super super like it smells really good you you do get the melons definitely you do get the strawberry like it's, it's pretty much a mixed fruity you know scent so if you're into fruity scents i suggest picking this up um i'm probably am gonna get another brick of this because that's how much i really liked it um, but I'm probably gonna let it sit for a while because maybe it will perform, a, a, you know, a little better. But it was good. This was a good scent. Oh my God, look at the color, you guys. If you like fruity scents, please pick this up on April 10th on my website, which is always down in the description down below. But April 10th, this comes out, this is good. Fruity scent and it's really, really good. So, um, my favorite one out of the five, I have to say, which is really, I didn't even say shocking, but Orchard by the Sea. This is so good. I didn't think I was gonna like it the way I like it. I really, really like it. I, Cause what it is, I'm not into aquatic scents, but this, like with all the things that's in it, it works super, super well. And then it's strong, like, but I did put it in my bedroom. So I haven't put it in my living room, but I am gonna put it in my living room. But so far, this is my top favorite one out of the five. Then I would have to go with Cucumber and Cactus for my second. It's just that good, it's that strong. And I like really good, clean, clean scents. Green scents, that's me all day. So I'm really not too picky with scents. Like I kind of like love them more. I just don't like, want them too aqua aquatic. And I'm not into woodsies and I'm not into those really heavy spicy cinnamon type of scents but other than that i love my scents all different kinds so this would be my second pick my third pick would have to be um summer berry melon that was really good then it would be pink apple and nectarine and then my last would be Beach Daisy. But Beach Daisy is really, like, it is so pretty, you guys. Like, I really like it. This is a really popular scent. Um, I put it as my last favorite on warm because it was light, you know. But like I said, I'm going to keep this brick for a while. Let it marinate in the oils. And then hopefully next time I use it, it's a lot stronger. But this is really pretty. So that was my um, review on the five... Summer bricks, you guys, these will be coming out April 10th. So if you're interested, my website is always down in the description of every video. Um, like I said, they come out, it will be, you can get one for 24 or you can do the bundles for two for 40, which is a really good deal. Woo! Two for 40 is um, a really good deal. So save you some coins right there, right? Save you eight dollars right there. So that's gonna be available April 10. Then um, the Mother's Day collection, okay? These come out on April 1st. Um, let me see. I have both of them here, but I'm gonna make sure I have the scent. Okay, I do. So we're gonna go ahead and start with the Blue Coconut um, Beach Scentsy Bar. So this is what it looks like. And then, Here's the color, and I used three of them in the bathroom. Um, I'll say this, this was just a little too aquatic for me, or like, it just, it really reminded me of Vanilla Waves. I, <laughs> I don't know if I'm the only consultant that feels that way, or the only person that has worn this, and like, 
we have a, a Scentsy bar that my son absolutely loves called Vanilla Waves. I'm not really into it because it's like a, a sea salt type of vanilla, if you know what I'm saying. I just, I don't like it. So this bar reminds me of Vanilla Waves. Um, I had it in my bathroom. I put three cubes in the full size warmer. It performed. Um, I, I would say it performed pretty well in the bathroom. It performed well, but I just did not like the scent because I don't really like Vanilla Waves. I know, I'm probably the only consultant that does not like Vanilla Waves or care for it, I guess I should say. I would probably use Vanilla Waves as a mixer, if anything. But this is what Blue Coconut Beach reminds me of. So yeah, um, if you're into Vanilla Waves and or like C type of scents, this is the bar for you. So that's that. And then the other one that's coming out for uh, Mother's Day is Wildflower Cotton. Now this one is, um, has the wax in it but the one I just used which is somewhere probably in my empties I'm not sure I used a whole brick okay I mean brick a whole bar excuse me in my living space in my hallway so that was in between five different warmers I used a whole bar um it was good I like this I like this better than the other one better than blue coconut beach um it was a like it like I was it was like woodsy clean let me read the description that would help okay zesty lemon and wildflowers bright and line line dried cotton among sun-kissed woods so i do some of the the uh, cotton and the woods S slightly just a little bit like a manly scent like a tiny bit it's not overly manly but um it performed okay like i would say the first couple hours it was it was good and it really died down. It didn't last for me too long at all. I wish it did because I love the way this smells on cold. Like if you get this bar and you smell it, you're gonna like think it's, I really thought when I first smelled it that it was gonna be like super, super strong, but it's not. But like I said, out of the two, the wildflower cotton is still my favorite. So these are the Mother Day um, scents that are coming out. You can, you can get these starting April 1st, okay? So that's that. So I just wanted to um, review both of those with you guys, warm reviews. I really hope you guys enjoyed my video. And if you did, make sure you hit the like button, comment down below, and subscribe. Let me know if you're new to my channel. Um, let me know if you're a Sensi addict like me. If you're a consultant, let me know. I would love to talk to you guys and all that. But until next video, you guys, it's your girl, Tisha Marie. Bye.